If you like your coffee like you like your Pokemon, shiny. Welcome. I was doing fossil resets on Let's Go Eevee, and I saved after getting like 39 fossils. So, you know, at least let's go Pikachu once the Mewtwo hunt is done, or if we get bored of this Mewtwo hunt, we've got our fossils here, but it's it's looking grim. Because it, it used to be functioning where if I got an Aerodactyl in one, at least I'd have the remaining Kabuto and Omnite fossils in the other. And now, well, for now, it's not. It really depends on how many more days this Mewtwo hunt goes. Because I've got uh, Let's Go Eevee saved in front of that fossil spot where I just grabbed the Helix there. Uh, it is randomized. So you can uh, save in front of it and soft reset for the one you want. Well today, we are going to at least 4600 attempts on Mewtwo. I, I don't know if I've got the 6 hours in me to bring it to 5k. But we will find out. We'll see how this starts going. Uh, shiny lock rules. I'll do shiny lock again. We aren't releasing them if they die in a shiny lock. I mean, obviously there's a shiny clause within the shiny lock that we're keeping the shinies that faint. We're just going to put them in the dead box. It should be pretty fun. Way more fun than this. But it, this is draining. Cyndaquil is my favorite Gen 2 starter. I didn't like the aesthetics of Totodile. Like, I don't like Torchic, but that's more about Combusken and Blaziken than it is about Torchic. For my very first starter was Trico. I started in Pokemon Sapphire. We're just gonna call this reset too, because uh, I haven't been counting. So it probably is way more than uh, 4,500, come to think of it, but uh, That's irrelevant. Any extra attempts that I don't actively count, you know, we can't just guess. Well, it's a numbers game, really, right? So, uh, statistically speaking, because it is possible, it will happen. I mean, we, we might be 3x odds, but it, it will happen eventually. I thought now would be a better time to stream, because I gotta have the lights on. And they, they get really hot, so on these 100 degree plus days, it's not very desirable to sit and stream, you know, past noon. <laughs> Noon's kind of a good cutoff for a rule. I mean, as far as getting started, you really don't want to be streaming between 2 and 4 on a 100 plus degree day with lights directly on you. It's, it's a bit of a pain. So if you ever see me streaming and there is no camera, probably because I'm just too sweaty. I don't want to be on camera when I'm sweaty and gross. <laughs> Shiny counter. I think it's Brandon Fearing off the top of my head, but I don't know. I'd have to look it up. In fact, why don't I? Just to be accurate. Yeah, it's the Shiny Hunt Shiny Counter app by... Brandon Fearing, I was right. Oh man, big fan, big fan. One hell of an application engineer. I'm always trying to make stuff easier for me on the editing side. I'll be honest, I'm an amateur editor, but I look at the shit that I made, you know, a month ago, and I go, okay, I'm getting better at this. Uh, just takes practice time, like any other skill. The more time you put into it, the better you're gonna get. But there, there's very much a thousand hour rule in things other than music. I mean, I, I'm a guitar player, so I like the idea of a thousand hour rule. You put a thousand hours into something, you become good at it. You want to be good at art? Draw for a thousand hours, you know? Put a thousand hours into your designs. and Not, not one design, don't get me wrong, you know, you're not putting a thousand hours into one little project, hopefully. That, that'd be something. I'd love to see an art piece that took a thousand hours. That. That'd be a sight. I'm sure they exist, right? Like, I'm sure there's plenty of examples. I don't know them. I'm not an art major. I'm an electrical engineering major, and that's all fine and handy. With a networking and cybersecurity background.
Yeah, fun stuff. <laughs> it's not. It's not. It's boring as shit. Uh, I'll be honest. It's kind of like this, actually. It's about the equivalent, job-wise, of a Mewtwo hunt. I don't think I make the same mistake too often. Biggest mistake I make is shiny hunting soft reset Pokemon. I like Eevee. Like, actual just Eevee is my favorite Pokemon. I, I think Eevee's just this little adorable thing. Look at it. Look at, look at the goofy little smile on the cover art. It's the... Love it, man. On my mouse pad. It gets real dusty out this way. So. Places we've established. I, uh, you know, got the puppers. He's not in here. His rope is. I don't know where he got off to. He's probably chilling right by the cooler. Uh, you know what, I promise you, he's just not in here because of the lights. He, he's in here any other time I'm doing office work. These lights come on, he's he's out. He knows how hot it's going to get. Still not shiny! It will be, though. Attempt 25. See, that's, that's what I gotta watch out for. I have crashed the game without checking if the Mewtwo is shiny before. Pokemon Sapphire Male Zubat was my first ever shiny. Just a green Zubat attacked me in a cave. So I was passing through. Turned it into Crobat. I'm really not a fan of green shinies. They are... They're kind of gross looking. And like, look at Dragonite, right? I love Dratini Shiny. I love Dragonair Shiny. And then there's Dragonite. And corrected from yesterday, it is not 1 in 1375. It is 1 in 136566. And that's because it's a weird decimal. Two to be shiny. We've been at this hunt for 45 days. This is day 46. 100 encounters a day, I, I get it. You know, a lot of people be doing, you know, 500. Okay, great for you. A lot of people don't try and keep a 3.9 in school. <laughs> I'm so burned. If I leave, I I may not come back to Mewtwo. Like uh, everything else in 2024, 2023, I'm sure it'll disappoint in the gaming world. The last game I bought, Day One was Diablo 4, so I think we all know how that went. 71! 72! 73! 75! <sighs> no luck on 77. I'm disheartened on this hunt. 88. Oh. I just loaded the wrong game. We don't have a Mewtwo in this one. Alright, this was how we got our Mewtwo for the living decks. Standard living decks, not shiny living decks. What a shame. Okay. Polyworld, nope, you're not shiny. That's okay. So, uh, 88. <laughs> I really, really need this Mewtwo to be shiny sh very soon. I am so burned out on this hunt. Can't wait to get back to normal hunts where we can actually catch. Anyways, y'all have a good day.